Hey guys, welcome to Convolution. My name is Khan, and today I'll be reacting to Ruby chapters four and five titled The First Step. And actually a pretty interesting title considering Professor Ospin actually mentioned something about it's up to you students to take the first step in the previous chapter. So I'm guessing this episode is going to be something like, you know, their first day of class or something like that. I'm really eager to see some new characters. So super excited. Can't wait. Without further ado, let's get started. Man, I don't think I'll ever get tired of hearing this song, man. Silhouette against the moon, bro! Yes! Oh, new character! Yes! <sighs> Two new characters! Yes! It's morning, it's morning, it's morning, <laughs> it's morning. I can't believe we've been at Beacon for a full 24 hours. Not that oh, so it's, it's just the next day. You're the perfect student and I'm, well, I'm me. But it's just crazy, <laughs> you know? We've been friends for so long. What are the odds we'd still be together? Well, no, <laughs> together, together. Not that I'm not saying... She's not clearly not into him, right? Not together, together. Right? Right. What was I thinking? He's like just so well, over her. <laughs> On a shame team together. Ooh, we should come up with some sort of plan to make sure we end up on the same team together. What if we bribe that master? Bribe the headmaster? I know. Come on. She's following him around the whole day. A secret signal. Oh, so look at his guns. They look so cool. Nora. Nora? His name's Ren. I don't think so. They folded to his sleeves. God damn, that's cool. Why it's perfect. Now we respect we're working together. Come on, Nora. Go. But not together, together. Not together, together. It's not just in my head, I right? I what those two are so worked up about. <laughs> oh, who knows? So, you seem awfully chipper this morning. <laughs> yep, no more awkward small talk or getting to know you stuff. Today, I get to let my sweetheart do the talking. <laughs> Ruby's like Crescent Rose, my precious. You going through initiation. <laughs> if you want to grow up, you're going to have to meet new people and learn to work together. That's true. Uh, you sound like dad. <laughs> First of all, what does many people have to do with fighting? And secondly, I don't need people to help me grow up. I drink milk. But what about <laughs> I drink teams? milk. White gold. I don't know. I, I'll just be on your team or something. Maybe you should try being on someone else's team. <gasps> How dare team. you! You do not wish to be on the same team as me? What? No, of course I do. I just thought, I don't know, maybe it would help you break out of your shell. What the? I don't need to break out of my shell. That's absolutely ridiculous. John, yes! Our natural blonde is back. I having to count that high. <gasps> oh, it's the new girl. Um, you guys mentioned her name. Have you given Pira, there you go. The team you would like to be on? I'm sure everyone must She looks so cool, dude. She looks Amazonian. Like armor, everything. Hmm. I'm not quite sure. I was planning on letting the chips fall where they may. Well, I was thinking maybe we could be on a team together. Mm. Well, that sounds grand. That sounds maybe. grand. This will be perfect. The smartest girl in class combined with the strongest girl in class. Together we will oh be Oh my stable. gosh, she's so like conniving and now, deceiving. We'll be popular, we'll be celebrities. <laughs> Man, this is hilarious. Great. Nothing could come between us now. You know what else is great? <laughs> Nothing except John. Yeah. Nice to meet you. You again? Nice to meet you, John. Yeah, yeah. So, John, what the hell are you doing, bro? I'm Talk with the girl who's actually gives an interest in you. No, you've got to be kidding me. Don't worry. What the hell? Are you brain dead? So, been hearing rumors about teams. I was thinking you and me would make a good one. What do you say? Actually, I think the teams are comprised of four students each, so... You don't say. Well, hot stuff, play your Do not call her hot stuff. She can kick your ass, I'm guessing. John, is it... Do you have any idea who you were talking to? Not the slightest, Snow Angel. This Snow Angel? Here. Hello again. Here, graduated top of her class at Sanctum. Oh, damn. Never heard of it. Oh, Sanctum. She's won the Mistral Regional Tournaments four years in a row. Damn! The what? You don't know jack shit! Every pumpkin Pete's marshmallow flakes box. <clears throat> That's you? <laughs> they only do that for Star Now he recognizes her. Characters. Yeah. It was She's pretty cool. Cereal? The cereal isn't very good for you. So, after hearing all of this, <laughs> Unfortunately, the cereal's not very good for you. To be on your team? I guess not. Sorry. Actually, Jean, 
I think you'd make a great leader. Don't oh, stop it. She's Seriously, nice. <laughs> stop it. This kind of behavior should not be encouraged. Sounds like Pierre's on board for Team Jean. Spots are filling up quick. Now I'm not supposed okay. to do this, but calm down, back off a little bit. Strings. Find a place. Coming off too strong. All right, that's a bit too close. Uh. Laura, a little help, please. Uh. Oh, God damn! <laughs> I'm sorry. We're all first year yeah, students are to be Beacon Cliff for initiation. Again, all first year students are to be Beacon Cliff immediately. It was nice meeting you. Oh, likewise. <laughs> Having oh, some trouble man. there, Lady Killer? I don't understand. Lady My Killer? My dad said all women look for is confidence. Where did I go wrong? You went a little bit too much Snow over. Angel probably wasn't the best start. Yeah. Come on, John. <laughs> Let's go. Aww. Ruby and John, such good For friends. For years, you have trained to become warriors. Oh, and today your abilities will be available. Oh, there's some other new the characters Emerald in the line Force. too, right? Now, I'm sure many of you have heard rumors about the teams. Well, allow us to put an end to your confusion. Each of you will be given teammates today. Oh, damn. What? <laughs> These teammates First day? will be with you for the rest of your time here at Beacon. So it is in your best interest to be paired oh, with someone with whom you can work well. Oh. That being said, like the first person you make eye contact with after landing will be your partner for the next four years. Four years? What? <laughs> exactly! See? I told you! After you've partnered up, <laughs> make your way to the northern end of the forest. You will meet opposition along the way. The freak? Like, it's a freaking Dumbledore and McGonagall sending all their students off path, into the Forbidden Forest! you will die. <laughs> Fight like spiders and centaurs and you shit! You will be monitored and graded for the duration of <laughs> your initiation. Like... <laughs> But our instructors will not intervene. You will find an abandoned temple at the end of the path containing several relics. Okay. Each pair must choose one and return to the top of the cliff. Mm. You will guard that a item test. as well as your standing and grade you appropriately. Are there any questions? Yeah, um, sir. Good. Now, <laughs> take your positions. <laughs> man, you don't give no shit, man. Everybody's like ready. This uh, guy's sir. asking questions. I've got um. <laughs> Question. Oh, what? They're launched into the forest? What? You can't just walk in? Uh, what, what is it? You're like dropping us off or something? No. You will be falling. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. So, like, did you hand out parachutes for us? <laughs> something tells me no. no. Yep. You will be using your own landing strategy. Uh, huh. It's coming closer. Damn, Yang's all cool. She ready for this shit. Um, what exactly is a landing strategy? <laughs> He's like spinning in the midair. You better hope there's a parachute in in your freaking shield, dude. <laughs> Osman doesn't give a shit. He's just drinking his coffee. He's like, bye, good luck. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Holy shit. Freaking John better hope there's a parachute in his ancient shield passed down the arc line for generations. All right, next episode. There we go. Silhouette against the moon, bruh. All right, here we go. Come on. Whew. I feel like I'm gonna get some action. Oh, she's using the recoil from her gun to soften her landing. So cool! Why do you get a girl? Oh, right, she can use the glyphs in midair. What you gonna do, Red? Oh, we like snakes. Oh, got this. So cool. We like. I don't even know what to say. Got that. Oh, golden like Get it, girl. Oh, she uses the recoil from her uh, Ember Silica to like propel her through the air like she's flying. The Super Saiyan all the way, bro. Blasting through trees and branches and shit. God damn! Nailed it. <laughs> Nailed it. Ooh, the drum work. Damn, she lands like an Amazon. It's a rifle! God damn, that's so cool! <laughs> Freaking John still landing. <laughs> it's a spear missile! It's a spear missile! Yeah! Thank you. <laughs> and pinpoint accuracy, she just saved John! <laughs> Think I'm in love! Gotta find Yang. Gotta find Yang. Gotta Pira! Find, find, find Pira, goddammit! Oh my god! Really bad. Oh, what 
if I can't find her? What if someone finds her first? Oh, there's always Jean. He's nice. Yeah. He's funny. <laughs> I don't think he's very good. In the no, you're correct. Oh, what about Blake? So mysterious, so calm. Plus, she likes books. Well, then again, I'm not sure I'd be able to hold a Just bribe her with books. Ugh. Okay. Who else do I know in this school? There's uh, John, you're forgetting a uh, like, snow angel. And... There you go. <laughs> the one girl who doesn't really like you. <laughs> of course you find her. <laughs> Wait. Where are you going? Twice <laughs> is like, nope. We're supposed to be teachers. Not this chick. Give her a chance, god damn it. <laughs> it, it caught him in the same place as the locker room. <laughs> Why is it like nah bruh? By no means You came back! She's like no, I ain't going with John. I'll take Ruby over John any day. John? <laughs> Do you have any spots left on your team? Oh Very funny. It's so cute! The strongest girl in class with the weakest boy in class, they're perfect for each other! I will not let Break me. that bottle, cut that ribbon, set that ship on sail, bro! I'll do it all day long! What the? I'm not slow, see? You don't have to worry about me! When did Weiss, just because I don't exactly know how to deal with people doesn't mean I don't know how to deal with monsters. You're gonna see a whole different side of me today, Weiss. And after it's all over, you're gonna be like, wow. That Ruby girl is really, really cool. <laughs> and I want to be your friend. Yeah, prove her wrong, Ruby. Get it, girl. <laughs> you may be fast, but you still excel at wasting time. Ruby? Oh, shit. It's getting darker, kind of. Ruby? And hey, you tell her. Oh, shit. Ruby, get your ass back here. She's surrounded, goddammit. Oh shit, that's a new type of grin we hadn't seen before! God damn! It's like an evolved version of those werewolves! <laughs> Dude, next episode's gonna be Azure Tech! Yes! Dude, this music just hypes you up for like battle, bro! Awesome two chapters, guys. I mean, oh my god, we got introduced to three new characters. Well, there's a there were a couple more in that line. If you guys, if you if you pay attention, but like, oh, of course, you guys already know. But uh, we didn't really know what their names were. But we got introduced to Nora, Ren, and Pira. God damn it, yeah, boy, with that freaking spear, muscle, rifle, think of a jig with pinpoint accuracy, freaking Amazonian goddess, throw that shit and save John's ass in a tree in the same pinpoint area when the fruit from the freaking locker room. Got God damn it, yes! Pira. Pira is like freaking, if like Xena mixed with freaking Wonder Woman, you know? If like, if you had, if you put Wonder Woman and freaking Bubbles from Powerpuff Girls and you put them together because she's so nice but so powerful and you know, she's so famous. She was like the, the top of her class in, uh, in another academy called Sanctum. She's on the cover of uh, that cereal box. That's crazy, dude. And of course, the cereal box must be famous because John didn't know who the hell she was until White mentioned the cereal box, right? I mean, come on. On, bro. And it's so funny. She's like, unfortunately, the cereal's not really good for you. But my God, and her armor, and like she had like little chained uh, earrings and like uh, like a like a tiara. My God, beautiful character design. Even more awesome, like weapon. Like the when the weapon comes out from a, like a rifle version to like configures into a spear. Like, dsh, 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 dsh. like I was losing my mind, bro. Oh, and of course we got Nora too, right? I mean, Nora is hilarious. She's like falling around Ren all the time. Good morning, good morning, all that kind of stuff. And it's clearly into Ren. It's like, oh, you know, you know, it's not like we're together, together, yeah, 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 yeah. Eating her pancakes and like, you know, I'm, 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 I'm talking to Ren at the same time. She's obviously clearly interested in Ren. And they said, and, and I noticed uh, her saying that they were uh, old school friends. They've known each other for a very long time. So I feel like she's been falling around Ren like all the time. And Ren's just like, oh my God, this girl. 
know. But you know, <laughs> at least. But Ren's it looks like you know she she's okay with her. You know, you know, following him the, him the whole time. You know what I mean? <laughs> and Ren, god damn it! Like her his his clothing looks very like Asian in quality and Asian in style, fabric and design, and the uh, the strappings especially. It looks very you know Asian Oriental design. So that's so cool. And like her his weapons have like sickles at the end of his guns, which he used to like wrap around the tree like a freaking snake design. I was, that stuff in his lighting is so cool, bro. And it like folded into his like uh, uh his sleeves so he can just pop him out and bring him out whenever he wants. Now that is awesome, bro. Uh, we haven't we haven't been introduced to Nora's weapon yet, but I'm, I'm sure it's gonna be crazy like her character, you know. And I really like Nora. She seems very fun and playful. Yeah, it'll be interesting how uh, Ren and uh, Nora uh, interact with Ruby and Yang and all these other characters. And freaking Yang, she's all like, you know, puts on her glasses, all confident, and like, just blast off and flying around and lands and nailed it. <laughs> Freaking awesome! And um, Ruby, of course, landing all cool with you using utilizing the recall from Crescent Rose, and Weiss, you know, utilizing her um her glyphs to soften her landing and kind of like define gravity in a way. We didn't really uh, see Blake very much these last two chapters. However, you know, we got a uh, John. <laughs> This brother, man, he's like, he started off like very cocky and overconfident and calling, you know, Pira like hot stuff and why snow angel and he's like being being a little bit too uh, much, you know, a little bit too extra and trying to get on their good side and John, I'm, I'm, I'm so glad like the end of the chapter uh, five, it was uh, John and Pira who met together because Pira seemed like she was, he was, she was legitimately interested in John and John just like push her aside like all mean and shit, you know, I thought Weiss was mean in the last episode, this episode was this these chapters were like about John being kind of like cocky and overconfident and Weiss is like uh, uh no no you're getting a little bit too close there for comfort man you know what I'm saying I'm, I'm so glad they ended up together the, the strongest girl in class with the weakest uh, boy in class I feel like they can learn so much from each other and like I ship Pira and John so hard right now I don't, yeah I'm, I'm, I, I don't know if that's like a legitimate ship you guys have but it has to be right and um yeah and then <laughs> Weiss at first he sees Ruby and it's like no nah, no, no. And then she sees John and she's like, yeah, uh, yeah, Ruby's a much better option. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go that way, okay? Yeah, yeah. See ya. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> and the freaking, the freaking Ospin and Glinda, like, they're like freaking sending them to the forbidden forest and just without parachutes and stuff. All the, all the students seem very highly prepared. John's like asking questions, like, yo, what's the landing situation, bro? Ospin's like, Ospin's like, landing situation, man. What the, what the, what the hell are you talking to, man? What school did you think you came to, man? Landing situation. Get the Get out of my face, bro. My husband just sipping his cup of tea, like, you know, like a thug. Smoke weed every day. It's like landing situation. I'll give you landing situation right here. <laughs> you know? Oh my god, I freaking love this episode. So what do you guys think about it? Is uh, Are you guys excited as I am or, or uh, re-excited as I am because you guys have already seen the show? Uh, leave your comments down below and um, I'll see you guys in uh, chapters six and seven titled The Emerald Forest. I guess we're gonna be spending a lot of time in the forest and meeting new characters and stuff. Leave your comments down below. I'll see you guys later in the next cha two chapters, all right? <laughs> Bye. Thanks again for watching and if you enjoyed this reaction, please leave a like, comment, subscribe and share and I will see you later.